If you're looking for the best fishing flow tubes, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, and reputation of the manufacturers and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have Classic Accessories Bighorn Fishing Flow Tube. The Bighorn Flow Tube by Classic Accessories combines extensive, organized storage with a pretty high degree of comfort for quite a reasonable cost. This is hands down one of the best overall value fishing flow tubes on the market. It includes all the most pivotal features you would want in a high-end flow tube without the high price tag. Side pockets with multiple entry points, a large rear pocket, and external mesh pockets give you quite a lot of space to stash gear. The seating does not include a firm foam pad like some of the higher-end flow tubes do, but it's still well-rated for comfort and posture support. The weight capacity is 300 pounds with the Bighorn, so there's plenty of room for even heavier anglers in their gear. Both spin fishermen and fly fishermen should do fine in this unit. Quality fabrics, a nicely positioned seat and stripping apron and tons of storage for every style fisherman, the Bighorn Flow Tube from Classic Accessories is no doubt a winner. Moving on to the next at number 2 with Classic Accessories Cumberland Backpackable Fishing Flow Tube. Here's another super popular flow tube option by Classic Accessories that should be on your radar, especially as a fly fisherman. The Cumberland Flow Tube is equipped with killer storage, a firm foam padded seat and a particularly hydrodynamic hull for greater ease kick paddling and tracking. This option furthermore has built-in shoulder straps for super easy carrying down to the water. Some anglers might prefer the superior organization offered by the Bighorn model, but both sidearm storage compartments are quite comparable at the end of the day. The Cumberland Flow Tube does, however, have two built-in rod holders that will really come in handy. You could even get creative and use them to set up an umbrella for some sun or rain protection. The number 3 position is held by Classic Accessories Tojik Inflatable Fishing Flow Tube. The Tojik by Classic Accessories is another backpack strap equipped flow tube option featuring impressive storage. This model has mixed reviews for seating positioning and support, so it may or may not be a good fit for you. While there are some complaints about the kick paddling orientation the seating provides, some anglers love it, so it seems like a matter of preference really. One thing that's for sure is that the storage capacity and organization potential is excellent with the Tojik. This bad boy has a nice array of zipper compartments and external mesh pockets and D-rings. You can even easily mount a rod using the side strapping or by adding an innovative outcast rod rack. As with all their products, Classic Accessories offers a one-year limited warranty with this flow tube so you can buy in confidence. Next at number 4 we have Caddis Sports Nevada Flow Tube. Here's a more budget option from Caddis Sports that might be more up your alley. This is a very straightforward option, no bells and whistles here. The U-shaped hull of the Nevada Gold Flow Tube is not as ideal for kick propulsion as some of the more mindfully designed hulls but you'll get to where you're going easy enough. Storage is adequate, several zippered compartments and the orientation of the stripping apron is effective. The only real downfall of this flow tube is the seating and lower 225 pound weight capacity. Heavier anglers might struggle to keep this vessel afloat, while shore fishermen may feel the seating puts them a little too low in the water to comfortably cast. The number 5 position is held by Classic Accessories Ted and Inflatable Fishing Flow Tube. Here is Classic Accessories most budget option of fishing flow tube. The Tenon Inflatable Fishing Flow Tube is a bare-bones option for those who just want to get offshore and onto the water. This flow tube will work fine for you if you're not a particularly technical fisherman. The seating is not padded or super supportive compared to a lot of the competition, but it's nonetheless positively reviewed by most anglers. Fly fishermen may wish they purchased something with a bit more interior space and height above the water, so be mindful of that detail. The storage potential with the Tenon is totally comparable to even high-end flow tube options. There may not be the same level of organization, but there's still plenty of space to stow gear between the two armor zippered pockets. External D-rings are furthermore present which are great for mounting your net or creel. The number 6 position is dominated by Lazo Inflatable Fishing Flow Tube. Having a great time flow tube fishing doesn't always mean breaking the bank. For the money this is one of the best flow tubes for fly fishing that we have seen. It offers great value. As with my previous suggestion, this tube for fishing is sturdy and very buoyant. 
the hull is shaped in such a way as to make it very easy to steer, and the high-quality 600 Oxford fabric is supremely reliable. It's the extras that make this a great choice. A really cool feature is the adjustable shoulder straps meaning you can sling this float tube onto your back and make your way to your favorite spot. This is topped off with velcro mounts to stow your fishing rods in a paddle if you so choose. Moving on to the next at number 7 with Gopless Inflatable Fishing Float Tube. If you like the look of our suggestions so far, but are really limited on budget then you are going to want something that is fairly cheap. You'll still get many great features but in the lowest price float tube available. This float tube comes in an eye-catching disruptive pattern material, making you one with the water. It is super lightweight too. This float tube is constructed of PVC and polyester offering great buoyancy. It offers great safety features, such as the incorporated seatbelt to keep you from slipping into the water. It has a storage box on either arm of the sizable flow tube to store bits, pieces and various items of tackle. The number 8 position is held by Wister Inflatable Fishing Flow Tube. This wallet-friendly option will get you out on the water and fishing. I'm quite amazed by the capacity. As long as you and your gear weigh less than 350 tubes, you can happily float along all day. Twin booms join make for an easy-to-navigate fishing tube. The 600 polyester material will keep you stable and secure throughout the day. As with our other offerings, this flow tube comes supplied with a pump and also repair kit so you can fish without worry of springing a leak. Boston valves on both booms allow you to fill them with air really easily, and at the end of a long day's fishing it is a breeze to remove the air ready for the walk back to base. Next, at number 9 we have Wistar Inflatable Fishing Patoon Boat. You may not be comfortable with your backside in the water or alternatively be limited in your ability to use your legs to paddle a tube. If that's the case then take a look at this. You'll have plenty of room to maneuver as you are suspended above the water by, not one, but two inflatable booms. A lightweight aluminum frame supports this spacious seat above the water, offering excellent visibility and freedom of movement. Speaking of movement, you can maneuver this craft in one of two ways, either by paddling your feet or by using the provided and easily stowable oars. There is plenty of room for gear too. Two sizable side pockets and a mesh seat back will allow you to fit all of your tackle. Numerous stainless steel D-rings also give ample scope to accessorize. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Caddis Pro 2000 Flow 2. Caddis Sports is another industry leader when it comes to great value fishing flow tubes. The Pro 2000 Flow Tube is no exception. The storage, comfort, and hull design of this option is well worth the reasonable cost. This unit is a bit lower profile than a lot of the competition, making kick paddling particularly easy. The pitoons are relatively narrow and come to a more of a point than a lot of standard U-shaped options. It's a neat design, but the weight capacity is only 250 pounds as a result so it might be a bit tight for larger sized anglers. The firm, adjustable seating is where the Pro 2000 really excels. This unit seats you nicely above the water for more effectively sighting structure in fish and unrestricted casting. That's all for today. We upload fishing product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon for the upcoming video notification.